Hi Jamal, how's it going? Duncan McKenzie McCarg here from Fox Sports Australia. Congratulations, amazing achievement. I'm not sure if you're aware though, but Tim Zhu was at the fight tonight watching you. Full respect for me, so just don't shoot the messenger here, but pre-fight he said he expected you to win, but also said that you're a little bit soft and that you don't bring the pressure. Can I get your response to that? And what do you make of Tim as a fighter? And would you like to fight him? Well, well, I saw him as a guy that fight, he should be quiet. He really did drop. He didn't really look so, I don't really watch a lot of boxing. No but just so happens, I did see him. And he didn't look so great. So, I mean, nothing to answer, nothing to answer. He didn't look so great the last time. He should work on his own situation. He, he said stylistically he'd match up well against you, you know. You got a pretty good point. Hey, it's different heat over here in America, baby. It's different heat in America. How much Tim, two, whatever the fucking name is, how much they got? How much money they got? Don't worry, bro. Would you take a fight against Tim? Fuck you, answer him, because you changed the life. Like, stop asking me questions, dude. Tim, Tim, have you got a message for Charlo after that brilliant performance? Not verbal. I hope, I hope I showed the message. You want to take a belt something? I don't think Charlie went scared. We're fighting sort of where everyone's scared from no one. That's just part of our mentality. It's not such a thing as being scared. It wants to move on from Charlie. Charlie's a real angry man. It's just how he is. He barks a lot. Um, Tony, on the other hand, he's a happy man. Happy at what he does. Enjoys life a bit more. Just rocking all the time.